We have pedestrians crossing. We have both sides being obstructed by construction fences. We're gonna make a left turn. This will be interesting. There we have it folks, it did it. It has to creep into the intersection. It's a wide intersection. We are going south on St. George Street. This is the University of Toronto. Look at the number of cyclists. This is not officially a crosswalk, but it did wait for pedestrians to cross. There is a bit of a hump on the road. FST did not have to stop, but humans do stop to allow pedestrians to walk by. But like I said, it's not officially a crosswalk. Coming up to an S curve intersection. Handled beautifully. So smooth. So natural. Yes, I'm talking about FSD and not a girl. <laughs> we have crosswalk, lights flashing, but no pedestrians crossing. It's great that FSD just ignored that.
We have a busy four-way stop sign here with pedestrians crossing. Well, this one was pretty easy. turn here see how that car proceeded through that's what FSD has to do the light turns red but in this situation it can proceed through to make the turn otherwise it'd be stuck blocking the crosswalk But obviously in a less dense environment, you wouldn't do that. We'll have to contend with oncoming traffic, cyclists, pedestrians, walking. This is not an easy intersection to deal with. A lot of times people get nervous driving in downtown Toronto, as you can clearly see why. There are just a lot of things to look out for. We're creeping correctly into the intersection and stop right here will be perfect, beautiful. And amazing, wow. Oh, wow, so smooth. Today we're lucky, no cyclists to contend with. We're gonna make a right turn here. Let's press, deal with this person making a left turn. <laughs> 